Barat's wearing his best macho man tonight. Oh, look at that! Elliot Bratz from behind. Well, we're getting this one started early, EJ. Hey, this is a championship match. Ellie Bratz knows that, taking every advantage he could. Clutch Adams doing the impossible, beating Brandon Scott at the last show. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, EJ, Brandon Scott's first loss here in PPW in over a year. Yeah, I mean, he, by hook or by crook, he managed to pull victories one way or the other. Finally caught up with him last month. Elliot Barat staying on Clutch Adams, something that I would recommend him doing. Clutch Adams, what an impressive athlete. Unloading here on Elliot Bratz. Bratz in the corner. Reverses the whip. Adams up and over. Goes for the hip toss, blocked by Bratz. Blocked by Adams, gets behind. Bratz holds on. Adams sent to the apron, catches himself, barely. Big shoulder to the midsection, knocks the wind out of Barats. A nice entrance by Adams, showing the ring awareness. Runs right into that knee, though. Yep. Brad showing he's a little ahead. And so far, Clutch Adams not doing much to, to quiet the critics that say that he may have just gotten lucky against Brandon Scott the last time out. That's what people are going to say until, about every champion until they make a few defenses. Sometimes it is a fluke. Sometimes someone gets lucky. I don't think that's the case here with Clutch Adams. Oh, we'll see. Then again, Elliot Baratz, a veteran in the squared circle. We've seen him here wrestle some very impressive opponents over the past year or so. He's been here at PPW. Can he win his first gold here tonight? Adams going to argue. If it was a two or a three. Yeah, Brett's, Brett's no slouch either, EJ. Spending time in Ohio Valley wrestling, being in the pages of the PWI 500. The Hebrew Hammer has come to Hazleton. He has impressed, and he's here for a reason. Clutch Adams. Getting a one more time from the crowd as another chop, and Eli Elliot Brett's just can shake his head no. And Adams again with a strong chop to the chest of Elia Baratz, the Hebrew Hammer. Look at this, Baratz brought down to the mat by a big chop across the chest from the PPW television champion, Clutch Adams. You got to know Clutch is Adam, looking. Go ahead. Adams goes for the plancha. It's caught, oh. sweeps the leg, Elliot Baratz. Baratz resorting to just about anything needed, and who can blame him? It's not every day that you get a championship, a championship match. I'll tell you what, that will bring Elliot Baratz to that next level he's been trying to get at here at PPW. He's been here, he's gone against the best PPW has to offer. However, gold has eluded him his entire tenure here at PPW. Clutch Adams getting rolled back into the ring. Baratz has got to put Adams away before, before Adams looks for that ro uh, rolling elbow that has put away Brandon Scott in the last match. 
I don't think we've ever seen Bratz as focused. He's relentless. He's methodical against Clutch Adams. He's yeah. shown his years of experience are coming out right now. And now he's repaying Clutch Adams for those chops just a couple minutes ago. The fans not as much behind those chops, but they still hurt the same, EJ. Absolutely. Something tells me Elliot Brad, he doesn't care what the fans think. Not at all. He might feed off, off of their uh, ill will towards him. Elliot Barats, one of the one of the tougher critics of Clutch Adams, t speaking to me before the contest, telling me that it was a fluke. Like I said, everyone's going to say that, Phil. Well, it's true. Clutch Adams can only quiet his critics by results. And that's the best part about that squared circle, EJ. You can talk all you want, but when that bell rings, it's go time. When it's time to strap up the boots, the time for talk is over. Look he at this. Barats keeping Clutch Adams grounded still. We're well underway in this matchup. Rear chin lock applied by Barats. Wearing down the television champion. Yeah, and although Clutch Adams new to gold here at PPW, a former Monster Factory heavyweight champion as well, he knows what it takes to defend titles. Look at that, big back body drop. Oh yeah, and that feels like 100 lighters right up against your skin, right on your back, EJ. That burns. Clutch Adams not even wanting to put his back on the ground, it's probably burning so much. Look at that, just pounding away at the WILN television champion. Bratz wants to know who the star is, and right now you'd be hard pressed to say anybody but him. Toying with Clutch Adams. Oh, slap across the face. Disrespect to the champion. Barats asking if this is Clutch Adams. Is this a champion? Getting a little ahead of himself. And Clutch Adams, here he comes on the warpath. Adamson, appreciate that. Ducks the clothesline. Big back elbow spinning through the air. Kip up. The champ is back in this one. Barat struggling in the corner, and a high knee, right to the skull. Sends him off the ropes. Barat's dropped oh. on his face, eats a super kick. Adams makes the cover, two, he reached a no. Only a two count. And Elliot Barat's feeling of his chin still connected to the rest of his face after that kick. As Clutch Adams shows the determination in his body to keep that television champion championship around his waist. And we are going to the high rent district, EJ. I don't know if he's willing himself or his, the fans more, but Clutch Adams is trying to get enough momentum to get to the top. Adams all the way up, Brad shakes the ropes. Desperation move. Paid off big time though. That's what we were talking about before. Barats is a veteran. Do not underestimate him. He knows every inch of that squared circle better than you know the back of your hand, Phil Bravado. And you know that pretty well. <laughs> so many people. Here we go. So many people are quick to talk to me about defending people who cheat. Listen to me. What Barats just did kept him in this match. What Barats just did showed the ring Whoa. awareness that I know. It's what Barats just did showed his experience in this ring. It's not cheat and Phil Bravado if you use your hand. This broadcast has gone off the off the rails. Clutch Adams sat up and perched on the top. As Barats takes his liberties on Clutch Adams' face. They're battling out here. Whoever comes down first may be the, may be the determining factor of this matchup. Adams trying to soften up Barats here right in front of us. I hope they don't come down this way. 
Down goes Bratz. Went for the clutch elbow. Came up empty. Bratz hooks the leg. Close. Bratz needs to go him. for a cover. Oh! Two and three quarters, you could have put a paper in between the mat and that hand. And the, and the frustration from Barat showing, and that might be something of good news, EJ, because there is going to be an onslaught of offense if Elliot Barat has anything to say about it. He's getting frustrated, but when you get frustrated, that's when you start making mistakes. You're right. Ellie Brads is praying right now. I would too. If, if he lands this, Clutch Adams is going to need every bit of it. Double underhook from Brads. Adams gets out. Ducks the clothesline. Thought we're, he's going to go for a roll. No! Knees him right to the face. Sets him up. Going for the clutch elbow here. Looking to put him away. Got him! Middle of the ring. And Clutch Adams, like everybody in Hazleton, stunned. Elliot Bratz is about the only one in this building who thought he could kick out of that, and he did. <laughs> Say what you want about Elliot Bratz. I thought that was it. I think everybody here did. And say what you want about Elliot Bratz, but he's showing that he deserves to be in this match, EJ. He's showing that he has the determination. And wait a minute! Bratz! And oh! A mistake by Barats because if he would have put his his legs on the middle rope, I do not believe the referee would have saw that. Adams. And again, Illy. Oh, and he, wait, you can't do that. He absolutely can't. What is this? What is this? He was cheating. The ref had to stop him from cheating. He was well within his rights to do that. Elliot Bratz came in here. He lost the two guys. One of them striped like a zebra. This is ridiculous.